Hey, uh, I wanted to share my progress update with you guys um, because it's been one year since I joined in myopia and one year since I discovered Jake Steiner and he's changed my life so much and I wanted to share the positivity with the group of what's possible. So uh, when I first discovered Jake uh, and endmyopia.org, um, I was sitting at a minus eight prescription uh, in my right eye and a minus 7.5 in my left. And then I also had 1.25 of astigmatism in each eye. So I was highly myopic and I had a very strong nearsightedness. And uh, this was really tough and I wore really thick glasses and I wasn't able to wear contact lenses at the time because I had severe dry eye. And um, I was became, becoming increasingly insecure about my glasses. So um, on a Googling frenzy one night, uh, I was searching through Quora for answers and I found Jake. And I just had so much hope and optimism when I started reading his material and watching his YouTube videos. Um, and also just seeing how dedicated he is to natural vision improvement and changing other people's lives um, for free. So. Uh, thank you, Jake, for all that you do. Um, you've changed my life and many others, and you're an inspiration, and you've inspired me to help others with their eyesight as well. So, um, like I said, I was highly, highly myopic when I first stumbled upon Jake, and today, it's um, one year since I discovered Jake, and I'm proud to announce that I am a minus 5.75 uh, in both eyes, so I've equalized and I now have no more astigmatism. Uh, and that's quite normal. It's normal for the astigmatism to go away when you're reducing um, spherical as well. Um, so I am just wanted to give a little progress update about that to the community. Um, if you have any uh, questions about my journey, I'd be happy to answer them, but I just wanted to do a quick video for the end myopia and natural vision improvement community because I would like you guys to just know what's possible. Um, also, I'm a software designer, so I spend the majority of my day in front of a computer and I'm not the greatest with active focus. I'm not like an active focus hero or anything, but um, I do try to take the 20-20-20 break, which is go look at something 20 feet away f every 20 minutes for a minimum of 20 seconds. Um, however, I did hear that they've recently increased that rule to one minute rather than 20 seconds, um, but I just look out the window. Uh, and, and I know that um, Others have had even better results than I have, and congratulations um, to those who were able to reduce, you know, three, four diopters in a year. Um, crazy. Um, and uh, I really look up to some of the Jake alumni that I've seen around the group, like um, Angie Hep. Uh, she's a big inspiration. Um, but for those of us with desk jobs, um, as long as you keep reducing that prescription and, you know, keep up with your differentials and make sure your monitor is not too close and, you know, try to stay at 20, 30, I think you'll do well. So thanks uh, so much and good luck to all of you.